Because it's haunted chamber I awoke in a small but clean cell. My skull was encased in a bloody bandage. A tall French man and two guards brought me food and water. The tall man was in charge. He cleaned and rebandaged my head, told me I was lucky to be alive. He knew my name, but I had no inkling of his identity. I refused the food and hurled insults, and to my great annoyance, the tall man shrugged carelessly and departed with his men. It's been months now, and my life is a drudgery of endless days spent in my tiny cell. I know not why I am imprisoned so cruelly and denied the rights of my rank and status. My every need is accommodated. Food, drink, warm clothing, fresh bedding, and a commode that is emptied and washed daily. But boredom drives me mad, and I demand the tall man kill me and be done with his cruel game. The tall man doesn't want me dead, imprisoned in the basement of a stately home that sits on a large estate. There were books in my cell which I hadn't touched. But one day, the tall man offered me the reward of a few hours a day working in an apple orchard if I read the novels and debated their morals with him. I am desperate for a break from my cell, so I agree to the request. Now I pick apples by day and return to my cell at night to have lively debates with the tall man on the ethics and moral principles novelists impress upon us. This is agreeable but difficult. It's as though the tall man is parading my faults before me. Self-censure is not easy for me, but I come to realize I have lived a selfish life and am capable of better. All is well until the tall man insists I read a book about an innocent woman's assault. This book reveals the reason for my incarceration. I am here because of the assault on the French girl at Hougoumont. Instinctively, I deny my guilt, but the tall man will have none of it. Thankfully, the young man I have grown into in this cell recognizes my lack of moral fortitude and I change my plea to guilty. I am Antelope, renamed Mary. Watch for further episodes or read the complete saga of my incredible journey. Antelope by Maria Hannah Whitley. Available at Amazon and other online bookstores.